All right, looks like we're on a line. Time to hit the buttons to get the notifications out there. Very nice. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we are playing Fallout today. I can't play as long, unfortunately, because I do have um, some things that need to get done, be done before tomorrow, basically, because uh, I got guests arriving and um, I need some time. Basically, I got a video that's got to be done by tomorrow so I can clean up the house all tomorrow, as well as play uh, Diablo 4, which is having a three-day beta starting tomorrow. So, the, uh, so I won't be playing quite as long, which means I'm going to be getting started a lot sooner. So we can clock, you know, a healthy hour in for today's stream and hopefully complete the uh, the Mechanist DLC, maybe even start the next DLC. Zen Master is first, once again, because he didn't have any competition. So it, do it doesn't count when he doesn't have competition. So, um, you know, what can you do? Uh, Michael Science is early gang alongside Cheeky BB and... Awesome Pork 101. You guys are the vanguard of the Fox Republic. Michael Science not happy about Zen getting it first. Uh, awesome Pork 101 says, glad to catch the stream. Hello. Uh, hello to you as well, good sir. Uh, Arf, touch and go, says he's got to get to do some stuff. Thank you, though, for the 50 bits. So the uh, yeah, let's just get started. Like I said, you know, I don't have as much time because like I need I need time to actually do the deep dive guide. So let's just get right to it. Um. Okay. So we we gotta talk Another to the thing. robot. Let's it's do it. It's astounding how much we still have to discover out here. All systems are a go, sir. Here you go, Ada. The final radar beacon. I'll need that head back when you're done. Of course. Shouldn't take but a moment. There you go. Still in one piece. I'm not sure why you want the head back. All we needed was its radar beacon. Besides, robo-brains are notorious for being... Well, a real pain in the neck. Um... The robo-brains? What else do you know about them? Quite simply, it's the first time General Atomics produced a successful union between organic matter and robotics. The brain is used both as a control unit and a data storage unit, which is far more efficient than using standard circuits. Unfortunately, there were a lot of programming issues with these robots, which caused them to be a bit, shall we say, unhinged. Hopefully, this particular robo-brain will have some of the answers that we've been seeking. Okay. A union of organic matter and robotics? Sounds an awful lot like a synth. Not at all. The Robo-Brain was built with a very different design philosophy in mind. General Atomic's intent was to use the human brain to augment the robot's functions. Primarily, to accelerate the decision-making process. Free thought and individuality was never intended. These were expressly built like soldiers, to follow orders without question. The Robo-Brain's unfortunate tendency towards violence and aggression should be considered more of a malfunction than a calculated decision. Okay. Now that you have the final radar beacon, will it be enough to track down the mechanist's location? I certainly hope so. I've already started the calculations while we've been having this conversation. That still doesn't explain why you need that head back. Right. We still need it, Ada. I believe it can help us access the mechanist's facility. Of course. It makes perfect sense that the mechanist would not only keep its location a closely guarded secret, but would secure it against intrusion as well. I'm terribly sorry. I hadn't considered that possibility at all. I'm afraid when it comes to assisting humans, I'm not doing very well lately. Um... Why would you say something like that? Isn't it obvious? Ever since I let my friends die in that caravan, I feel like I've been failing in my duties. I chose the route we took the day we were attacked. Perhaps if I had selected an alternate route, they'd still be alive. Sometimes I wish that Jackson had programmed me with my personality mode set permanently to disabled. Yeah, yeah, we don't have time for this. I don't really have time for this right now. Yes, you're right, of course. I'm sorry. I won't bring it up again. 
Now I've distracted you for long enough. I'll finish up my calculations while you deal with our new friend, Jezebel. Hopefully, she'll be able to grant us access to the Mechanist's facility, and we can put an end to this nonsense once and for all. Okay, so... I think all we have to do now is build the robot, I'm guessing, hopefully. Uh, awesome Pork says, the Mechanist DLC, never played it, mainly because I heard it wasn't great. I have no idea. I just bought the, the whole bundle package where you get all the DLCs. I heard this one wasn't very long, so why not the Mechanist? Okay, so I guess I gotta build the robot. How do I do it? New robot? Yes, new robot. Okay, do okay, there we go. We we use the robot head. Um, I guess that's everything we need there. Um Is it can I just leave it the way it is? Build base bot? Wait, wait, what do I need to do? You lack components you lack will be tagged with a space bar. So I do I just need to choose all of them? Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay. We'll just make him a protectron, which I assume is the most basic of all robots. Paint? No paint. You're not you're not good enough to have paint. Okay, so why can't I build this one? The legs look a little weird. Is something wrong with the legs? Do I need to give it armor? I was kind of hoping to skip the armor. I mean, I guess we could just like, I guess we could just give it the armor. Give it the basic armor? What's the cheapest armor we can give it? Here we go, this looks pretty cheap. One, two, two, two. Yeah, that looks pretty cheap. That looks cheap. Do you really need a mod? Whatever. Let's just let's just go through the full customization process. Factory armor. Damn, we're running out of rubber. Oh, I can give it a weapon. Um, how about I don't know, a laser blasting thing? Yeah, nice. Okay, it's not done yet. We need we need a little more work on it. Hopefully. Oh, it's done. Yeah. Interesting. This body you've selected for me isn't quite what I had envisioned, but it will have to suffice. Yeah, what were you expecting? Well, I was going to connect your head to Liberty Prime's body, but I decided to do a little arts and crafts instead. Disappointed? If you're attempting to use sarcasm as an intimidation tactic, I'm afraid you're wasting your time. Look. It's obvious we don't care for each other's company, which suits me just fine. So, why don't you ask me everything you wanted to know, and then I'll be on my way. Sure, um... The Mechanist. Tell me everything you know about the Mechanist. Now there's a fascinating subject. The Mechanist. Amazingly adept at programming. A veritable genius with electronics. I'm not surprised you're interested. I've been dutifully carrying out the Mechanist's instructions to help the people of the Commonwealth for quite a long time. Really? You're lying. You're lying. After all the trouble you've given me, why would you help a human? Well, it's my primary directive, which I obey without question. The Mechanist instructed me to seek out and help the people of the Commonwealth. By my calculations, the easiest way to help a human is simply to destroy it. There's no point in prolonging a laughably fragile life. It's the most efficient way to assist them. 
Any other effort to help tends to result in numerous complex side effects. Yeah, 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 that's fine. Yeah, so are you going to tell me where the mechanist is? The mechanist gave you these instructions? To kill people? Well, not exactly. The specific instruction was to help people. I merely interpreted the most efficient way to perform my duties. Assisting a human to the best of my abilities only affords a 25% survival rate. That means there's a 75% chance that despite my efforts, the human I'm assisting will die from something beyond my control. Therefore, it's better to hasten the human's death and put them out of their likely chance of misery than to deplete my limited time. It's actually quite elementary, but given your minimal intellect, I suppose I shouldn't be surprised you don't understand. Yeah, I need you to help me find the mechanist. Like, you know, I, that's very cool that you like killing people and stuff, but what about Can the mechanist? Can we stop with the petty bickering and just get to the part where you tell me how to access the mechanist's facility? I promised to answer your questions. And unlike humans, I don't have the capacity to lie. It's rather simple, really. In order to gain entry to the mechanist facility, you're going to need to outfit one of your robots with an MSAT modification. I'll upload the plans to your Pip-Boy device. There. I've fulfilled my portion of our agreement. Perhaps I'll remain here for a while and see how things resolve between yourself and the mechanist. Purely for my own amusement, of course. I suspect you'll have quite a tale to tell once you return. But then again, I'd be surprised if you ever return at all. Can I just destroy you now? Nice. Okay. That's the end of that weird robot. Um, what we can do now is... Oh, we gotta talk to Ada. Gotta talk to Ada. I've been wanting to kill that crazy robot since I met her, but unfortunately the game wouldn't allow me to do it. So that's the end of Crazy Robot. Uh, first time chat from Elvin. Elvin. Uh oh, this is one of these difficult names. Let's call him Elvin. First time chat from Elvin says, Hello, Mr. Fox. Welcome to the show, good sir. The Samurai of the Commonwealth is here to bring honor to the Commonwealth. I've already brought a great deal of honor to um, Good Neighbor. And now I'm going to, uh, I, I have to take measure of the, I, I have to measure their honor before I make any decisions. Perhaps we should seek shelter. I trust you've completed your business with Jezebel. I hope she wasn't too difficult. Nah, nah, she just talks a lot. Um, got what we needed. Let, let's not talk about what Jezebel. We Good. What did she say we need to access the mechanist facility? The... She's dead, by the way. It requires an MSAT. I need to outfit a robot with something called an MSAT. Jezebel gave me the plans. A custom modification that acts as a key to the mechanist facility. Very smart. In fact, chances are high the MSAT may be required for multiple access points, like a robot identification card. As for my task, I was able to decrypt the signal with the final radar beacon. The source is coming from a Robco Sales and Service Center, most likely a front for a larger operation. It's time to take the offensive. Have you formulated a plan? Um... Kill the mechanist. This mechanist is a real threat. I only see one of us walking away from this one. I won't disagree, but it may be beneficial to discover motive and reasoning first. Now, if you're ready, I believe you have an MSAT to install. Would you allow me to assist you on this no. mission? No. Actually, maybe. Are you volunteering for that MSAT? I may be a robot, but I feel a strong amount of personal investment to see this mission through. I will do anything I can to help. Okay, you can join. Of course, Ada. Let's go. Lead okay, away. that means I won't have to build another robot? Uh, let's send him to, um, where is Sanctuary Hills? Okay, so what that means Who is that I, I don't have to build another robot because I don't know if I have enough materials to build another robot. No more Lone Sir, Wanderer? Yeah, but that's, I, I can live without the, you know, like the Lone Wanderer makes us stronger, 
but it's not like it's not the end all be all. Like you know, we we can we can live without the lone wanderer for a mission. Yeah. Oh, these are those barricades I built. It's all good. You know, we can we can live without Lone Wanderer for just one. You know, just just for the convenience of not having to construct a totally new robot. Here we go. Okay, we need to give the M set beacon. Here it is. I need rubber. Of course I do. It's always fascinating watching you create. Here we go. Uh, what's the command to scrap? R. There we go. Rubber, 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 rubber. Should be enough rubber. Okay. The MSAT beacon right here. We got it. Very nice. And I mean, I guess we can see if there's any other upgrades I can do. Hydraulic frames? That's some crazy stuff you can do, isn't there? There's a lot of things you can do to these robots. What kind of weapons can you have, though? A left arm? A hand claw, a right arm, a hand laser. Can I give you like tank legs? A so, so oh yeah, protectron. You you could be a hovering body. Oh, I see. You need science. You need skill in science and an armor. Interesting. I see. So, basically, this is where strength and intelligence actually kind of meet together. What about for weapons? Science and robotics expert? Interesting. So, there's an entire skill involving... Um, where is the weapon located? That's one thing I don't know. Where do I control? How do I control what weapon it's on with? I'm guessing it's the arm. Sentry right arm, sentry left arm, factory armor. Oh, here we go, a laser. So you have a hand claw, a baton. You can smack people with a billy club. Now that's the kind of robot I would want. A pincher. A flamethrower. A laser. A zapper? A hook. I could make a robot named Sanford. Um, smacker. Um, a zap smacker. A chopper. An ice thrower. An automatic laser. A smasher. A pinchy hand. A very pinchy hand. Screw! Oh my god, a drill hand? You can have drill hands? You can have saw hands? You can have lightning hands? A nail gun? An automatic laser? A scattering laser? A sniper laser? You can become an Assassin's Creed stealth blade? A shish... A, is it... It's possible that robots are honorable? Is that... Is it possible that robots are honorable? And I didn't know it? You could shoot people with radiation? A machine gun? Missile launcher? This is a lot of weapons. Holy crap! What are, can the other... Uh, does it work on the other arm as well? Do they only get one weapon or can you put two weapons on them, I wonder? That's crazy. What are the, I didn't see what skills these require. Blacksmith and science. Science and blacksmith. So it looks... Oh, gun nut. Gun nut. To make the nail gun, you would need gun nut. 
So it looks like the main skills here are science, gun nut, robotics expert, blacksmithing and armoring. Man, in order to completely optimize your um, your robot, like you would need a lot of skills. I can give her sexy legs. How do I do that? How do I give her sexy legs? Robo brain treads? Are those the sexy legs? Oh, it's the Assaultron legs. How did I just change it? I didn't have to build it? You need to put some clothes on, Ada. Hold on a second. You, you need to have some clothing on. Like this is like a, a this is a child-friendly stream we've got going on here. Ah, uh, here we go. I don't know what I'm building, but I'm building it. There we go. There we go. There we go. I did it. I had the model in my inventory. I see. I, I'm really scratching my head on this one. Where, where do my robot parts go? Oh, they're in the workshop. They're in the workshop. Is this where they are? Do they go under robot parts? Why don't robot parts get their own part or list? Is the Protectron just as uh, whatever? I'm getting let's let's we got we got a mechanist to go meet. Okay, the mechanist is oh, it's actually near the um the airport. Oh, he's working right underneath the um he's working right underneath the Brotherhood's nose. So I've been told by my um, by my community that I can create uh, I can designate a town to have basically a, a, a robot death pit where I can sent sentence dishonorable members of the community to fight you know fight for their for glory one last time against like suicidal odds they have to fight like the robots and I can create death robots to destroy them. I'm like, wow, that means maybe robots are more honorable than I thought. Well, at least um, at least the robots aren't pretending to be human. Okay, so here we are at the Robco Sales and Service Center. Let's do it. Well, we're fighting robots, so let me get my robot slaying sword out. This robot slaying sword is actually coming in a lot of handy. First time chat from I'm Depressed. He said, Fallout should have something like the Dark Brotherhood. What would they be called? The, like, the Dark Brotherhood? But in fall the Fallout? They, they could be called the Fallout Dark Brotherhood. That, that would make sense. There you go. The fall Fallout doesn't really have any, like... I guess the only consistent faction that we fight, really, or that we interact with, is the Brotherhood of Steel. Since, like, there's always an, there's always the Fighters Guild, you know, the Mages Guild, the Thieves Guild, in every one of the um, the Elder Scrolls game. Okay, here we go. If I had access to a vacuum modification, I could make this place shine. Yeah, but what you really have is the Egg Beater. The egg beater modification and the laser arm modification. All right, let's see what we've got here. Oh, Robco Sales and Service Center. Let's hack. House sizes, terms, paths, tight, harem. Okay, none of these words have anything in common with one another. So let's start with... 
harem. One likeness. Okay. I don't think anything ends with an M. Let's try house. I'm in. Boom! Service requests? This is these are just like work. Oh, safe control. Disengage the lock. You certainly have a knack for adapting to technology. There we go. Give me all your stuff. Give me your stuff. Shocking! That is an expert locked door. I can't do expert. I think I can only do novice. We are no we are we are not known for what is this? Open this. Ada. Over here. Where did she go? This is why I don't trust robots. Oh, there you are. Here, you gotta do something with this. Here. You're showing it your, like, robot boobs? Oh, that was the M-Set. So the M-Set is robot boobs. Why can't I collect these robot parts? It would save me from having to build them. Incoming robot detected. Opening security doors. Zen Masters thinks that we traded nudes for access. Wow, this is um, a lot of maximum security doors. That sure seems like a lot of lasers, I'm just saying. Oh well! It didn't work. Get him with the egg beater. Oh, she's using the egg beater on him. The mechanist! Wow, that was easy. My robot chopping sword is more than a match for these guys. 50% more damage to robots. Oh, a tool case. I'm just obsessed with unlocking these things. I don't care if there's nothing good in it. I just like unlocking them. Okay, so we're looking for the mechanist. Over here. More robot nudes. This place is like security level Omega. Ammo box. Oh, come on. How about right here? Right here? 
There we go. Nice. Okay, let's continue on. Oh, Mechanist, I'm uh, just uh, inviting myself into your house. Past all like 27 of your security systems. Oh, you get it with the egg beater. A baseball. Pack of duct tape. A tank bot. Those guys always explode when you defeat them. Ooh! Okay, while you're doing that with the egg beater, I'm gonna hack this. Image, ghost, blade, surge, prone, and check. A lot of these end with an E, so let's start with prone. Okay. Nothing else starts with a P. Nothing else starts... goes into an R. Oh, it could be Ghost. Let's do Surge. Nice. Yeah! Got him! Oh. Hey, where'd all that fire come from? Wow, that did a lot of damage. Who did that? This guy does a lot of damage. Hold up now, hold up now. Let me activate all my stuff. This guy is not playing games. This guy is here. This guy means business. There we go. No, they keep stun locking me. There we go. Look at that hit. There we go. You're not going to get me. I can't get a hit on him. This guy does a truck ton of damage, let me tell you. That was his undoing, though. He's vulnerable when he goes for that laser. Oh, oh, what's happening? Stop exploding! Stop exploding! Okay. Oh, gosh! Oh. Charge! Good gravy. We need some rad away. We're getting some decent items. I don't know if I'm actually going to use any of them, but... Soda. Soda. Chief Engineer's Terminal. Maintenance issues. I am not gonna read all of these. This looks like a bunch of like lore stuff. Look, we, we're, I'm on a tight. I'm on a tight schedule today. I can't be reading lore stuff that's long. Oh, a work a robot workbench. I guess if I wanted to make modifications here, I could. Day Tripper? What the hell is Day Tripper? That looked like a drug of some kind. Day Tripper. Luck, Charisma, Strength, but Strength minus two. Luck and Charisma up, but Strength minus. Oh, that's for weaklings then.
Okay, I'm not sure exactly what we're looking for. Let me go and heal myself up. Okay, let's move it. Hmm, hard hat. I'll take it as a souvenir. Got him, got him. Food. Moldy food. Another big robot. Attack the robot. Oh, this guy does a lot of knockback. There we go. Attack from both directions. Oh, they always, I keep forgetting they explode. Everything explodes! What does this button do? Hmm, carton of cigarettes. I guess it makes sense that there's a lot of, like, um... Crafting materials here, considering that you know this is probably the place you'd need to go to. Oh, Over here we here. go. Time for robot nudes. Robot nudes. This place is like crazy, the amount of security that we have to go through. Another one! Use this. I see you got the old egg beater warmed up. Toolbox. Yes. I'll take it. Okay, what else could they have in store for us? Dead. Sounds like we got another fight on our hands. Okay, this is the these these ones were kind of rough. We got to be careful of those ones there. Oh, here we go. That one's dead. Another robo bench. Which way should we go? We can go left or right. I think power substation. That seems more important. Let's go this way. Ooh, that was a nasty. It snuck that nasty hit in. Okay, this actually does look more like the right way now that I'm looking at it. Let's try the power substation. Whatever. Only weaklings are afraid of radiation. The power substation terminal. What is this going to do? Uh, what a waste. I've been here almost four months now and I'm already getting bored. These don't... I, I was wondering if we could get something from the mechanist, but like that doesn't... That looks like stuff from a Robco employee. Oh, soda. No so Oh, one soda. Nice. Onwards. Okay. 
Okay, didn't need to push that button. Okay, what are we in, like, the trash compactor scene from Star Wars? The time to fight is now! Oh, I'm drinking water! I'm not trying to do that. I'm trying to grab this stuff. Oh, this one's not actually dead. Haha! Oh, I'm chopping everybody. That's what you don't get in my way. Let me drink some water. Oh, it's actually not that bad. The water is not that bad. Why can't I just drink continuously? Facilities management. So be it. Facilities management. Interesting. Got it? Got it. What else do we have here? Workbench. Robot! Another button. What does this one do? Uh oh, we gotta get on. There we go, get on, there we go. So now we're on like this crane or something. It's uh, this, uh, this, this dungeon, so to speak, is uh, pretty in depth. And good thing I have my trusty robot slaying sword. Okay, robot Here. nudes time. Ooh, some psycho. Let's do it. Use this. Subway thing. All right, we're in. Where is this mechanist hiding? Bone cutter, surgical tray. Oh, oh more goodness. robot nudes. So far, so good. Medical supplies, always welcome. We got a computer over here. Watch station terminal. Ah, uh, these are just more logs, I assume? Yep. We can go that way. What about this way? Okay, both of these doors lead somewhere. Let's do the research lab. That sounds like an important place. What is this? Forfeiture. Property storage. Oh, this sounds like my kind. Oh, we got a master lock here, or a master one here. Out number, complexion, calculated, constantly, everything, and adrenaline. Wow. Huh. Calculated, those at least, we got three of them st that start with C's. Let's start with complexion. Nothing, so they can't start with a C.
Um, how about everything? Wow. That means it's either adrenaline or it's outnumbered. E. Let me see if any of these words have some some similar slots. N. It can't be adrenaline because adrenaline has a second to last N, so it's it's got to be outnumbered. Yes. Boom. Open the door. Open the door. Open the door. Empirical vibes rage with a party of three. First time, oh, first time Raiders coming in from Empirical Vibes and R. Lazarevit. La Lazarevit? Oh, man, these are some rough names. But yes, how is it going, everybody? I am doing the Mechanist DLC for the first time. Ah, uh, let me see. Ammo, ammo. Gold? I don't think I've ever seen gold before. A blue, a blue baseball bat. Weapons, drugs, guns, ammo, 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 ammo. This place was pretty good. I'm just going to take all of this stuff. I don't know if I want it, but I'm taking it. I'm doing it. Okay. What's this hat? I want that hat. Oh, I want that too. All right. I've got my robot slaying sword. And now we're gonna go into the research lab, which sounds important, so it must be the right way. You love the Mechanist DLC. I've never, this is the first time I've ever played Fallout. I've made it through the primary campaign, but I've never done the DLCs before either. So it's, it's quite, it is, an, it is an experience. This has a robo brain on here. Hmm. 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 Very interesting. What's this? Acid? <laughs> like literally, like like tripping off some acid? Oh no, it's miscellaneous junk, isn't it? I see. It's not like acid. What are we looking for in here? There's a giant button. Let me hold off on pushing that for a moment. Hmm. Maybe I should push that button down. This upstairs area looks equally important. I hear something. Oh! What are they doing with ghoul? Oh, is this? An, I think this is an elevator. I think that's an elevator that's going to go down. So let's check this area up here. What is this? Medical observation terminal. Okay, so these are about the patients they have here. History. Convicted of seri- Oh! I bet these are for robo-brains. I bet that they are chopping these people up for robo brains. I've, I bet it. Not to be visited alone, security personnel required. Yeah, these are people that they're going to chop up for robo brains, I bet. I bet. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All of these guys are murderers, basically. Interesting. Interesting. That's what these guys are. That's a Protectron toy. I like toys. Do I like Ada? I don't have much of an opinion about her because I am a lone wanderer character. So I typically do not adventure with companions. So this is the first time I've brought Ada with me. Alright, I'm guessing that this is a um, an elevator. On the chat's request, we gave her sexy legs. Or should I say specifically on Zen Master's request?
This one doesn't have a brain in it. Brain extraction, yep. Yeah. Cerebral reconditioning. Let's check brain extraction first. Cerebral reconditioning. I'm not gonna, like, read all of this. Like, yeah, this is, like, way too much. I'm running on a tight schedule today because I gotta make that video for YouTube, so I can't... I can't spend much time dilly-dallying. We gotta... We gotta... We got a job to do. We gotta get it done. What are these? Uh, brain extraction? Can I assume that this is all logs? Yep. These are all logs. Antiseptic. Jet and Psycho. Purified water. Stim packs and rat away. A stim pack. Med X. Ooh, love Med X. Always running out of Med X. I don't think we went into the Robo Brain R and D lab. This man has uh, some problems. He's got horns growing out of his head. Okay. Nothing too interesting there. Wow, look at all these brains. I see that one there. Do battle! Do battle! Oh, wait. I don't know who I'm attacking, but I'm attacking. I'm very good at attacking. The laser is your doom. Got him. My self-diagnostic looks green. Ready to get back to the hey. ocean. Okay. I guess we just like hooked her arms back on. Over here. Certainly. Okay, back to exploring. Military fatigues, adhesive. A restricted area. Okay, I guess we had the password. Uh, let's open the security door. But I don't want to go through it yet. View batch status? Are these all more logs? Yeah, these all are all logs. Okay, so we'll go in there in a moment. Let's check the rest of this area out. This is an incinerator. Interesting. Like, I want to... Wait there. No problem. Follow. Come on. I'll get it done. Why? How do, how do I stop that from... Whatever. Like, I'm constantly in the mode of giving her orders, and I forget how... Oh, okay, I guess gotta hit tab. I see. Machine gun turret. Mentats and buff out. Very interesting. This looks like, um, like a forge or something. Whiskey. Okay, let's move on. I think we've seen everything that we can see within this area. Onwards. Make sure it's dead. Make sure it's dead.
Rad X, I'll take it. More yeah. robot nudes required. Yes, this is my first playthrough of Fallout 4. I've completed the primary story, and now I am doing the DLCs based on whatever order chat wants me to do it in. Oh, have I been the good neighbor? <laughs> you could say I've been the good neighbor. Is this it? Um, so this is the mechanist. He looks like a, uh, like a 1940s villain. Um, let's talk first. Okay. There seems to be some sort of misunderstanding here. Maybe we should talk about this. The Commonwealth has suffered more than its fair share of injustices because of you. I am the one that decides what is justice. He wishes to challenge me? Very well. It is time we use our true power. And perfectly preserved pie. Slice! Can I kill them while they're in there? No, I can't. Attack! Loot his body before he hits the ground. Where's the next wave of them in? Come on, get bring them in here while my jet's going. Cyber swarm bot? Oh, this is like a heavily modified Mr. Handy looking thing. To battle! Turrets, fight with honor. Come down and face me. These like hovering ones are kind of cool, actually. That one exploded. Their bodies are flipping out. Do we talk some more? Look around you. This entire facility is at my command. For every robot you destroy, ten more will come. Struggle all you want. There is nothing you can do to stop me. Nothing. Warning. Power generation capacity exceeded. Now drawing reserve power. Sparks! I'll deal with you myself. Oh, he's gonna fight me himself? I don't know if that's good for your health. She, like, gave him the egg beater from behind. She, like, put the egg beater in his receptacle. Attack! Protectrons are so comedic, they just kind of, like, fall over. Who is shooting me? I can't be beaten by robots. Robots do not understand the meaning of being the samurai of the commonwealth. Am 
landmines. Am I supposed to do something? I wasn't paying complete attention. Oh, a worthy foe. Dual bot. Honorable. His skills are impressive. You were a fool. The moment you pulled out a ranged weapon was your undoing. You look like you need a hand. Here we go. Wait, what did I get? Something purple? I looted something purple. Okay, I think they're above again. Landmines? Man, is this, is this what it feels like to be Sonic the Hedgehog? There's one! No, here they are. Too slow on the draw. Okay, I think we disabled all of his robots. I hope that number countdown isn't bad news for me. Are you out of robots yet? I will not rest until I see the Commonwealth free of you. Um, coward! Coward! Quit hiding. Come face me, you coward. I watched you survive what should have been a guaranteed attempt to stop you. Besides, do you truly think I'd leave the safety of my command center? Yes. Fight me! Fight me! Bots take orders. You're the only one with the motivation to stop me. Now show me what you got and fight me. Fine. I'll show you what I'm truly capable of. There we go. We have an honorable duel. This is more like it. Prepare yourself. Ah, it's a two on two. Your minion was weak. Your undoing. Your undoing was playing with robots when you should have been playing with gym equipment. The mechanist is a girl. Wow. Plot twist! I am on whatever the default difficulty is. Oh, look at all these robo-brains. 
I am on whatever the difficulty defaults you to. I did not change anything about the difficulty. Master control terminal. Let's find out what this does. Uh, cancel the security alert? Sure. Um, assembly line control? I can't do anything about that. Okay. Shadow Ravenous says, Hey Fox, what are your thoughts on the new State of UK 2 update? I, I, well, I'll put it this way. There's a reason why I'm not playing State of Decay anymore. Like, I, I am, like, I think it is their most brain-dead, brain-dead idea. And so I'm, I'm not going to play the game with such a brain-dead idea. That's why we're playing Fallout instead. Plasma card. Okay, I guess we did it. That was, that was actually a pretty cool final thing. Oh, wait, we, let's talk to Ada. I'd be happy to help if I can. Talk. Ada? You've done it. You stopped the mechanist. Um. Why is it there isn't an appropriate answer? The appropriate answer is for honor! The mechanist is dead. One less crazy in the Commonwealth. A just end for the pain and suffering inflicted. It does not bring back my friends. But if not for their deaths, the Mechanist may still be alive, posing a threat to the Commonwealth. Had those robots remained unchecked, I'm certain the damage would have been extensive, halting, if not reversing, any progress that has been made here. With this knowledge, I am finally registering feelings of satisfaction and accomplishment. And I have you to thank for it. As a result, I have decided to stay here. There is one remaining matter to consider. The mechanist is defeated, but my radar beacon is still picking up several signals. I Interesting. Feel the Commonwealth is still littered with those rogue robots. Eliminating them would be tying up loose ends, to use a common phrase. Seriously? Seriously? How many robots are out there? The signals suggest quite a few. Oh, uh, okay, so I'm guessing this is how they're going to generate radiant quests so that you can get more robot parts when you need it is is that i that's what i'm assuming sure good let me see yes i'm picking up a signal sending you the location did i kill the mechanist well here is the arm of the mechanist and here is the head of the mechanist Aren't you staying yes, here? Sir. Didn't you say you were going to stay here? Where was I? Okay, we need to... I'm pretty sure... Oh, this wasn't open before. Freight elevator. Oh, that sounds awesome. Tool case. Oh! It broke immediately. Got it. That's it. Okay. Stim pack. Stim pack. An IV bag. All right. Are we, well, let's go. That that wasn't bad. You know the 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 mechanist quest. You know I, I found it a little bit tedious to get the initial kind of like. The little radar beacons I thought was a little tedious going to all those different areas. But the final area, the, the actual, the dungeon, let, well, that's what we'll call it, the Robco dungeon, was pretty cool. Adjustable wrench, screwdriver. Cigarettes. Well, there we go. I think we did it. We are we are done with the mechanist quest. Um, I guess now. Wait, I guess I should take a look at what equipment I got from the mechanist. That's something I should do. 
Because I'm, sh I'm sh typically in the DLC, they give you at least, you know, one kind of an interesting item. And now we also have the ability to construct robots. I'm told that um, I could build, like, a robot death arena and then sentence all of the dishonorable citizens of the Fox Republic there to, to duel the death robots. And I'm like, that seems like a pretty entertaining idea. What the hell was that? I'm under attack. By not robots? Wrong place at the wrong time, pal. Robots! I don't know what all these guys are waiting for me here for, but... Violence protocols. I am always a violence pro. Oh god, got him with the egg beater. There we go. Excellent. Get him. Well, and then we get a bunch of Institute weapons to sell off, too. Even better. And we gained a level. All in all, I'll take it. Carrying all that weight is simply slowing you down. Okay, fine. Heads up. How may I be of service? You... Let's take a look at what you've got. You carry these things. Let me be a little careful on how I am depositing these because I do want to see if I got any unique items real fast. Some of those things I didn't recognize the name of. This was a lot of... Uh, Institute robots. Okay, let's see what we got from the um, bowler cap. We got fortifying, synth left arm, hard hat right. We got martyrs pack stuffed left leg. The mechanist's armor. Oh, is this like a full suit of armor? Reduces the damage from robots by 15%. The mechanist health... <laughs> How do you, um, how do you rotate the camera around your character? What, what is the command to do that? I, I want to see what I look like. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's what I'm wearing. I'm wearing that. I, I'm convinced. I'm convinced that that's what I need to wear. Okay, let me see what weapon we got. Improvise, maximize, institute, something, kneecappers, combat knife. What does it do? 20% chance to cripple the leg. That's pretty funny. Um, Mr. Handy buzz blade. Why does it do so little damage? Oh, because you hold it down. There's got to be someone for me to try this on. I've got to try this on someone. There's got to be someone I can try this on. Are you joking? There's not a single enemy around when I actually need it. I know what to do. I know what to do. I know where there's always enemies. There's always enemies just in the middle of, like, the good neighbor area. There's just always people there. Where's good neighbor at? Just 
Dude, here, how about right over here? I, I gotta try this on somebody. Look at this crazy thing. What the hell is this thing? Looks like something from, like, Warhammer 40k. Pretty cool looking, though. I don't think I fought one yet either. But now that I notice it, it looks like it has one of those Assaultron laser faces. It's just going through the eyeball. Oh, I'm too heavy. Hold That's on. I we gotta trade some stuff. Perfect. Okay, like, we gotta find somebody to try this on. You're guessing that we're doing an evil playthrough? I have no idea what that even means. Would you like some? Would you like some? And of course they're cowards and they hide up here instead of coming down to fight me honorably. Okay, let me see if we got any other weapons from this. Yeah, that, that saw blade is interesting, but the, da the damage isn't quite there. The damage isn't really... Cool weapon, but the damage isn't there. I think that's everything. Okay, yeah, I think that was everything that we got from it. Okay, we're good. Let's fast travel back to the red rocket. Why does it keep showing me this thing? Now that I'm looking at it, I think it's a highly customized uh, Assaultron. It's got the Assaultron uh, egg beater hands. Okay, give me all my Look stuff alive. back. Yes. Looking to lighten your load. All of it. Now, we're going to limp our way over here to my storage. I don't like to sell too much on stream, mainly because I don't think it's very fun to watch. So, I actually sell in between the streams, and what I do is just throw them in here. A blue baseball bat. That knife is kind of cool, but uh, no. this weapon here was kind of interesting. If it did more damage, I'd be willing to give it more of a try, but doesn't quite do the damage I'm looking for. Commando. Oh, this one's better. A better commando helmet? Oh, it was the helmet. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. That's what I was wearing previously. I see, I see now. Okay, I'm gonna put the helmet in, and that's right, we're wearing the mechanist helmet now. I forgot about that. Okay, looking good, looking good, looking good. All right. What is your body still doing here? Be gone and away with you. Look alive. Yes. I gotta swap her out. We're 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 going back to dog meat. Like she she was useful for this DLC, but we're going back to dog meat. I left Dogmeat somewhere in Sanctuary Hills. Hopefully he's not, like, hiding somewhere. Mr. Fox, well... 
That still creeps me out when he calls me by my name. It creeps me out because that's what people call me in real life as well. Okay, where is Dogmeat at? Is there some way to locate your followers? Inside of a doghouse. Do we have a doghouse is the next question. Do I just have to, like, man right. literally just manually locate him? Don't talk to me, Preston. Oh, I thought that was him right there. Mr. Fox, welcome yep, back. yep, that's my name. Brings me back like nightmares to when I was working in retailing. Oh, Mr. Fox. Okay, I'm going to look for dog meat later, because I don't know where dog meat went. Anyways, like I said, this this stream this week useful. is going to be a shorter one, because uh, I have company coming in tomorrow. Not tomorrow. I have to be ready tomorrow for company on Saturday. So, I cannot stream for the full, like, three to four hours like I normally do. So... That is going to be that. So we completed the Mechanist DLC. Like overall, it was uh, it was interesting. I think the real value of the Mechanist DLC is definitely in the the um, I building the robots rather than in the adventure itself. The uh, the the dungeon though that you fight the Mechanist in, I think, was a pretty interesting one. So it is a uh, you know it's interesting. I, I enjoyed. It. That was pretty good. And, yeah, we will continue on. I believe uh, I was told that two of the DLCs are kind of on the shorter side, similar to the Mechanist, uh, including the Mechanist DLC. And then two of the DLCs are on the lengthier side, which would be Nuka World and Far Harbor, or at least how it was explained to me through my uh, community. So we're going to do the short ones first. Then what we will do are the long ones uh, later. But if you would like to see my adventure thus far, like see how a first-time Fallout player went through the... Not, not a first-time Fallout player. I have played Fallout 3 in New Vegas. But a first-time Fallout 4 player went through the game, then all you got to do is scroll down from my chat or scroll down from my stream and hit up the Fox VODs channel. This is where I upload all of my past streams. Uh, you're watching episode 11. Last episode was 10, this is 11, and that is where they are all going to wind up. And if you'd like to become a part of the Fox Republic, remember you can find me on Discord, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Anyways, once again, apologies for the uh, the shorter stream. Like, uh, I figured I'd at least get something in, but yeah, I got a lot of work to do after this, and then I got to be ready tomorrow to clean up the house, and then Saturday I do have uh, out-of-state guests visiting. So, lots of stuff to do. Anyways, thank you so much for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed my playthrough of the Mechanist DLC. Uh, that is the end of the stream week for me, so I will be back. I might be back next week. I don't know. You know, I don't. I don't want to spend too much time away from having my guests over. You know, I think it would be rude to invite people over and then, um, you know, not spend time with them. So I don't know what my stream schedule next week is going to look like. Until next time, though, everybody, follow me on Twitch so you're notified when I go live next. But at the end of the day, of course, remember that you don't have to be good. To get good.